Good evening. My name is Brightops, and welcome back to Mordheim, City of the Damned. Last time we started the Bright Crusade off to a relatively pretty good start. And since we not only engaged an undead warband, but we didn't lose anyone. Which is honestly... The fact that we won that in a victory without losses? That is a pretty solid win, right there. We've also taken the time to give... to go back to the store, and we got Ben Davy the Silent and Miss Lana some light armor. And in the case of Ben, of ben Davy the Silent, we gave him access to... well, a great... a, a secondary weapon. Since we still have the standard Geary started off with, but we've also now decided to buy him a, a gr Sigma Right Great Hammer. Basically, the two handed equivalent of uh, his starting weapon. Which will not only allow him to cast his prayers to the same degree as before, but now can smack a bitch in the face a lot harder. But anyway, that's now that people are caught up to it, let's see what the new day has to bring. A new shipment has been requested. See, Warbands Hill and Hearty. I don't think we've ever seen that message in the, with the forgot, forgetful iron wolves before. And we have a shipment request. How many do we have? 75. We've currently got 30, so we're already about halfway there. Wonderful. But let's see... What missions do we have available to us? Okay, we've got a Crush Their Will, with average stone but very poor gear. Marked for Death, average stone, average gear. And another Marked for Death, which is also a Horrors of Mortime. So really, in this case, we're just going to go for this one, because both of the two Marked for Deaths were the same scenario. It's just the rewards were Small different. Small groups of enemy warriors have been discovered across the area, scattered in fright. Before they can regroup, you break your warband into three patrols to intercept and engage your disorganized rivals. All right, so for once, we are not the people who are currently running for their lives. We're the ones doing the ambushing. And the we're after here. Holy Tomes suggests that we're going after a Sisters of Sigma warband. Oh boy. I will admit, I'm not a hundred percent sure exactly... Yep, yes we are. The sig... Though I will admit, I'm not a hundred percent sure exactly what the... in-character reason for the sisters to be fighting each other actually is. I will admit. Because... With other factions, yeah, it kind of makes sense in a in a bizarre way. Okay, wait, we've already got sights on people. There's one of our targets right there, but yeah, we. Well, we kind of don't want to do just charge straight in like, like, well, idiots, really. Because, as we've seen of the sisters before, they can be quite dangerous, and this, and we've seen had losses to them before, though not with the Bright Crusade. I don't... Oh, there's our second target. Wonderful. But yes, I see no real problem about gathering our forces together to make 
their big push. And I just realized I was running in the wrong goddamn direction. That would have been awkward. I almost had egg all over my face right there. Still, at the, if nothing else, we have managed to secure ourselves a fair bit of coinage. Especially this early on. Okay, I know you are not our target, but... Hang on, just see. Yeah, we can do this. <laughs> I was just seeing if we could not only cast charge charger, but also try and get a blessing of. Wow, that's just. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I have never seen unworthy happened before. Nor ha and especially I haven't seen it happen twice. Like one after the other. This is just... <laughs> Alright, that's one stone. If pretty sure if we go upstairs we can potentially find another. There it is. Actually, we can potentially find three. Because we do need the stone. And Grey Vested is remarkably suited to go and get it. Just gonna have to wait for them to come. There we go. It's the attack of the frails. <laughs> See, are you the. Yes, you are the one we were after. Okay, we've got ourselves a target. A new round has started. All right. We can trust the we can trust those two to destroy their leader. Or we would if they could actually hit hit the bitch. Because apparently some people just don't like getting hit in the face with a frail. Just some people. Ugh. Okay, she's made her all alone check. She's gone for six months. Whoa. And that was another... That was punishment. Seriously, I have never seen divine abilities have such poor... Well, just response. Before, it's for... It's honestly amazing. Okay, there's our second target, who is currently heading upwards. And 
possibly just came back down. Yep, there. There she is. I am not 100% sure what she was trying to accomplish there, but... Well, this isn't the first time we've seen the AI kind of derp a little bit. I'm... But at any rate... We see that we've got a little, fr a little friend trying to sneak up behind, flank around to offer their glorious, glorious leader some assistance. Let's try and cut that off at the pass, shall we? Very nicely done. And there goes target number one. A new round has started. Objective completed. Objectives updated. Okay, let's... Let's give Grey Vested some support. Because they need it. Now there is a fairly good chance that... Tempting, but... Not what we're after right now. Though... Eh. No real point taking it, simply because... If, if we had, all that would have likely happened was... Well, at, at best, what would have, all that would have happened was we would have something to sell. And she's failed? <gasps> and she's gone. Nice. And bizarrely, we still have... The enemy still hasn't broken. It seems that the sisters have much better morale than their undead counterparts. But I guess that does make that does make a fair degree of sense when you consider <gasps> that the undead are more or less set up to well, to be to be reliant on their vampire leader. Especially early on. And the frail wars continue. Unfortunately, Miss Lana's earlier injuries sadly did not pan out. As much as I would love to kill this one and take her down, the problem is that I don't think we'd be able to withdraw if we did that. And the problem with that is... Well, if we can't withdraw, then we can't... Then they'll just break and be done, and they'll be done. Reversed had to go down, but Ta God damn it. She was the one with the spell too. Bastards. But effectively, in order to secure a A new round has started. The secondary objective. <laughs> we need we needed to take we need to have someone in position to 
rush in there and claim and claim that t bounty before it has a chance <laughs> has a chance to get away from us. That's proving problematic because our people just aren't hitting them. Uh oh. Oh, this is going bad. We're slowly being rolled. A new round has started. Okay. Can I pull... I cannot pull out of the situation. Which isn't great. <laughs> Still, as much as it sucks to... Admit we can still at least win, or to, or put ourselves in a position to try to. Let's see if they break. Yep, they've fallen. <laughs> Damn it! I will admit that was probably a bit more costly than I would have liked, but strength so in close. steel wins a fight. But it is your strength of spirit that wins battles. As much as it sucks that we just kept missing and thus the battle went the way it did, at least we won. Let's see what injuries we've gotten. Okay, Miss Lana had a near-death experience. Under the circumstances, best we could hope for. Let's see, Aiden is now a muck, so they are, they will never disengage or flee from an enemy again. Also, under the circumstances, it's not the worst. Let's see, Grey Vested has gained Megalomania, which actually is perfectly fine, simply because I'm fairly certain that Grey Vested that Grey Vested doesn't actually, cannot actually use ranged weapons and doesn't have spells. Let's see, we did get some heavy armor out of that, which is great. And pay for the upkeep. Unfortunately, this does mean that we're gonna have to hire ourselves a second hero at some point we will definitely have to look into who what we wish to bring along but until next time my name is bright ops and i look forward to hearing from you